Welcome to Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about digestion. Digestion is the breakdown of food into small particles so they can be absorbed into the blood. The digestive system breaks down food, absorbs nutrients, and eliminates waste. Digestion starts in the mouth. This involves both mechanical digestion, the chewing of food, and chemical digestion. Teeth chew food into small pieces. Also, while chewing, saliva is mixed in with the food to aid in swallowing and to start breaking down starches into simple foods. After passing through the esophagus, the food enters the stomach, where it is churned into a thick liquid called chyme. Hydrochloric acid, excreted from periental cells, lowers the pH in the stomach and this helps increase the effectiveness of pepsin, which is an enzyme that begins the digestion of proteins. The chyme is then passed to the first section of the small intestine. Here, bile, which is created at the liver and stored in the gallbladder, begins to break down the fat. Enzymes created at the pancreas are also added to the food. Three pancreatic enzymes help digest nutrients. Lipase breaks down fat molecules into acids. Amylase reduces starches into simple carbohydrates. And trypsin breaks up the proteins. The walls of the small intestines are lined with folds and tiny finger-like projections called villi. This increases the surface area of the small intestine. Each villi contains capillaries and a lymphatic vessel. Nutrients diffuse through the thin walls of the villus and into either the capillaries or lymphatic vessels. Fatty acids go into the lymphatic vessels and amino acids and simple sugars flow into the capillaries. The capillaries and lymphatic vessels deliver the nutrients to the bloodstream where they are transported to body cells. The small intestine is very long and it measures up to 23 feet in length. The large intestine is larger because of its diameter and is full of bacteria. Excess water absorbed in the large intestine and a mixture of waste material, bacteria and mucus are passed to the rectum where it is eliminated through an opening called the anus. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.